The Centenarian Project, it's an intergenerational arts initiative and it's basically where we match up 100 skilled teenage artists with 100 people over the age of 100 and each pair gets to meet multiple times and gets to know each other and then our teenagers go away and create a portrait of their partnered centenarian and those portraits go on to create an exhibition. Well, I just thought it would be very interesting and perhaps rewarding to somebody else. It's been beautiful, yes! <laughs> Peggy likes to talk with younger people, like I like to talk with older people and I like them to share their experience with me and then we learn from that. She's a really good friend. That's me, I was the eldest one. Then the other one. I really like to meet her every week, like I'm just waiting for Saturdays and Sundays to go and meet Peggy. You look like more like... We've really seen some beautiful friendships already blossom in this rendition of the project. Loneliness is a huge issue across age groups, but particularly for older people. And it's something we need to change and we can all benefit so much from spending time together across the generations. I'm from Afghanistan, but I was born in Iran. I was not allowed to go to school, and uh, that's why we moved to Indonesia. And I was living in Indonesia as a refugee, and then I lived there about four years. So when I came to Australia, I started school from year nine. Now I'm year ten. When I was living in Indonesia, I met my teacher there, and then he helped me to draw, and I get interested on it every day more. He's uh, the best writer in Afghanistan, in my country. Mm -hmm. His name is Mohammed Khatib. That was the only thing I was doing there and it was like keeping me like don't think about anything else like my feelings like I just sketch them in a piece of paper and make myself calm. Oh that's very nice. Really. Yeah. When she was younger it's like the same as like me. I think she's a very inspiring young girl and I just wish her all the best in whatever she's going to do. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> Getting to know your subject means that you not only create a portrait but you create a portrait that has meaning because you've spent time with this person and you've got to know them and because you're going to gift it to them at the end you are connected through this artwork. I'll put it up on the wall for sure. <laughs>